Okay, welcome aboard again. As you can see, this is us just leaving Rosedale Abbey. So this is the second part of the North Yorkshire Moors trip that uh, we did a couple of weeks ago. So we're just trundling out along the lanes from uh, Rosedale Abbey now, and this is a nice little run. Don't think this road has a number, but uh, I will put on the uh, the names of the lanes from the maps. So hopefully that's uh, helpful to you if you fancy having a ride along it. So uh, sit back, enjoy the ride. We're slowly working our way sort of south and also a little bit east and eventually we're going to be joining the A171 towards Thursk. So uh, these, are, these are popular motorcycling roads and rightly so, they're very nice. So this is the, the village of Cropton and uh, quite a few little hamlets along this road so um, easy to get a bit confused. Um, as you can see now we're in Relton. And it's not too far past Relton before we uh, come to the A171. So this junction here, left is to Pickering and right is towards uh, Thirsk via Helmsley and uh, so we're lucky to get out onto the 171 towards Thirsk. Still got plenty of blue sky so um, this is a nice trip, we're just coming into Kirby Moorside. Kirby Moorside not a particularly big place but it is quite a long uh, sprawling uh, village so you'll know when you're passing through it. And some lovely bits of riding road between uh, Kirby Moorside and Helmsley. Some nice uh, sweeping bends so we're just enjoying uh, dry roads and uh, some blue sky. Um, I won't make comments about it being Bedlam, I think it's pronounced Beedlam. Once we're out of Beedlam though, some more uh, reasonably nice open road before we approach Helmsley. This time we're coming into Helmsley from the east. Uh, last uh, couple of videos back you saw us coming in actually uh, the opposite way, straight on there we turned right. Today we're going to be staying with the 171 turning left here. Plenty of bikes in Helmsley today um, and it's a great deal busier than it was the other day but then this is a weekend so uh, good to see people are out anyway and uh, taking advantage of a nice day. And again a couple of videos back we turned left and headed towards Malton here but uh, we're going to stop with the 171 today round to the right and up towards, uh, well eventually towards Thirsk via Sutton Bank. So I've heard this described as a, as a fast road. Um, actually I think um, the fast has got everything to do with uh, what you're doing with your right hand on the throttle. <laughs> 
uh, and nothing to do with the road but uh, it is well known for uh, for speed cameras and uh, we're just about to come off the escarpment here um, down Sutton Bank and uh, there's some pretty impressive hairpin bends on here this is a uh, one of the few roads in Britain where caravans are banned um, and HGVs uh, quite often get stuck. Interestingly enough they're very keen to blame uh, cars for getting stuck but uh, who knows. Anyway come off Sutton Bank and um, as soon as we're off Sutton Bank we've again got a few pleasant reasonably straight miles before, we're, before we start to approach Thursk. And once we're beyond Sutton we eventually cross over the A19 which we're just doing there and it's not too far into Thursk now. Left will take you to the south at the roundabout, straight on takes you into the town centre, right will take you north. We're uh, going to go and find ourselves a, a cup of tea somewhere. So thanks very much for watching, please click like and subscribe. Um, you can click like even if you haven't, it helps. And hopefully you look forward to seeing you on the next video. Cheers for now.